Good morning. The time is 7.49. Time for another vlog. Good morning, everyone. It is Saturday, and it's 8.45 in the morning. It's a little later than I wanted it to be. I was hoping to leave the house by 8, but things happen. I decided on hitting the gym today, so this will be new for most of you. Um, and once I get into that routine on a daily or by or you know, every other day basis or however, you'll start to see that being a routine as well. About two, three years ago, I was seeing a, uh, <clears throat> a fitness trainer when the gym by me opened up and it was kind of part of the introduction package to you know joining the local gym. And I kept them for a good year and a half. Um, you know, a couple times a week usually. And his routine was you have to go every day. Yeah, I was going practically every day, whether it was with him or without him, but I would go and do my routine and and I lost a good, I think I lost like 75 pounds or so with him from start to end. But then I hit a plateau and, you know, he wouldn't, you know, we were still doing what we were doing, but we weren't doing anything to lose any more. Um, and at that point we were in a muscle building phase, so I wasn't expecting to lose any more. I probably was losing still weight, but I was just gaining more muscle, so... I kind of, I was at a plateau, and it wasn't bad. I was very happy with the results and, and, and so on, but it was just getting a little expensive at that point because at that point I didn't really need the trainer anymore because he did his job and it was getting expensive for me and I wasn't really seeing any anything new out of it. It was really the same routine over and over and over and over again, so I just started going on my own. Um... And I did that for a good year, and I, I kept the weight generally around the same. But then what happened is, you know, you start... Um, oh, I remember what it was. I actually started a new role at work, and it required me being in the office very early um, to do certain things. Because during the day, I just couldn't get anything done. So I had to get in before everybody else got in, so I could at least catch up on stuff. And this was at a point where I wasn't working remotely every day. I was in the office practically every day so it was um, a challenge indeed times we had customers coming in um, that I had to greet and meet and have meetings with and I just didn't think it would be appropriate because what happens is when I work out in the morning even after I shower and done change and everything I'm sweating like a pig for like six hours and that just won't go away that's just how my body is and how it reacts and how it burns fat and everything and that's nothing there's nothing wrong with that but you know when you're meeting with a client you don't want to be sweating because it doesn't leave off a good vibe but anyway so I started going alternate days and then a couple times a week and I kind of slacked off a bit um, then last year um, I think it was last year no it was the year before last year um, I started up the routine again, and I was going uh, regularly, and then I started having the arm pain um, that you guys may know about, but <clears throat> with that pain, I was still going, but every time I went to the gym, my arm was just completely in shock, I, so I couldn't go, and I wasn't motivated to go because I didn't want to go through the pain of, oh my god, my arm hurts. A few months passed, and I went through the physical therapy, my arm pain's under control, I'm under some... Um, muscle relaxers and I haven't really been in pain I figured I would try going back to the gym again today but I also want to go not just for the health and everything but I also want to go for my arm I want to do some arm exercises and continue strengthening that muscle because I think that that pain I got was something along those lines because when I was seeing the trainer I was he was exercising every body part known to man arms, legs, you know chest, you know whatever and since I hadn't done such a rigorous exercise in so long, my body probably just, you know, go, go, go um, my body probably just go, went into a funk and, and I started having pains because I hadn't gone. To try to go every day, at least at first, so that I can get my body back into the swing of it. Uh, but what happens is when you go every day 
and you do it for a while, you get used to it. Like you want to go every day. And sometimes your schedule just doesn't permit you to go when I want to go. Like I could go every day if I, cho if I chose, but I don't want to go every day and have to wake up at like three in the morning to go. Because I was doing that at one point. I was waking up at three, four a.m. every day, getting ready, running to the gym so that I could do my routine and then go to work. And I mean, it was good, but it wasn't good. I wasn't getting enough sleep. And if you don't get enough sleep, then you know you're. It's not healthy for you either. So yeah, I am arriving at the fitness facility again. I, I this gym is called Twenty Four Hour Fitness. It's a big. West Coast chain, but they're starting to pop up, uh, pop up out east, and it's a nice facility. I knew about them when I went out for uh, a business trip in California one year, and um, that's all they had out in California. Practically, it was like one every other corner. And when they opened one up here in Jersey, I was like, "Oh wow, I know this company." Here, so I'm going to. Uh, Hit the gym. Hi there. So that was a quite long workout. Oh, it was good actually to be back. Um, I'm wearing this hoodie, but I don't like it. Oh, it's it's. I want to call, I want to say it's tight, but I don't think it's tight. I just think that's the way it, it runs. I'd rather clothing were loose, a little bit loose. Um, but it's time for muscle milk. That's actually part of my routine. I usually have these for snacks throughout the day. So that way, I, you know, when meal times come, I'm not as hungry as I would normally be. So usually you have to have this after, after a workout. All right. So it's time to run a couple of quick errands. It's raining out, so I don't want to be out too long. Hopefully there's no traffic, and I'll see you guys in a bit. Hey guys, so it is me again. Um, pretty busy afternoon. Um, I'm actually finally catching up on some hockey from Thursday night, and then I have to watch today's game because I watched Mets baseball live. So lots of sports, and also I am I have created a couple of unboxings, and I am also trying to edit. Wednesday's vlog and I also want to try to edit tonight's vlog so a lot of stuff going on so I want to get it all done before I go to bed um, so that I don't have anything outstanding tomorrow's a hockey game uh, so we'll see how that goes um, I'm here uh, finally uploaded my vlogs and my unboxings and I am just hanging out in a Google Hangout here you guys can hey, Joel, probably check your see. Facebook. 